guys, welcome back to Once Upon a Time. Let's continue. And that's why Rosetti wearing clothes doesn't stop the devil from kidnapping you. What? I don't remember this save. Let's try here. The queen... All right, let's see. Really? Uh, really? Yeah. They're always with their boobs out, or worse, completely naked. Well, if that's what it takes... Stop! Tinker is the fairest one of all! Why? I don't think Emmy would agree to that. And if you want to see her naked, ask her. I don't want to be held accountable for any disputes between my employees. <laughs> no fun. Yes, it's true. What a pity. Anyway, this body suits me much better. <laughs> Thanks for the coin. <laughs> Let's hope the next one works. I'm sure it will. See you later, sir. So I don't remember the other save, so we're just going to go with what we're going with. Let's do this. Sweet. We do need to start getting our credits back up. Alright, so we'll call it there. We didn't do too bad today. Good night. Whoa, that's quite the change. It's drastic for sure. You like it? It's pretty cool. Yeah, totally. It's really fucking badass. So, we had a deal, right? Okay, so we have done this. So, I will be right back. Alrighty, so let's go do this. We'll finish up Snow White. That might have been my save. I legitimately can't remember some of the stuff. So, <laughs> let's see. Hello again, good to see you. I got a new one. Oh, great. Let's go. There's the well. Tell me when, to make, when you make your wish, I'll throw the coin. All right, all right. Hmm. There you go, you can throw it. Really? I feel like my back aches. Okay, so we've done this one. So I'm going to go through um, and skip a couple things. I'll be back when we actually do it. Sorry, guys. I'm just going to go with this save. And if I did, like, if this save came out of nowhere, just let me know. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do it that way. And that's why Rosette wearing clothes doesn't stop the devil from kidnapping you. Huh? Lady Emmy, a man. It's the devil. He's come to capture me. Run! Dude, what are you doing here? Don't ask me. I'm supposed to be at headquarters right now. Tinker? Huh? Where the hell are you doing next to Emmy? You're not supposed to be there. Bloody hell, Tinker. You're the one that controls the teleporter, not me. I'm not. Oh yeah, you're right. I switched the... My bad, sorry. I'm really sorry about that. 
I hope that didn't fuck up your Android completely. It's o It's okay. She probably just ran back to her tower and is cowering under her bed right now. That's what happened the last time after we saw a big fat grasshopper. So yeah, sorry about that earlier, guys. Hopefully this is the save. So how's your mission going? Ease challenging mission if I've ever seen one. Hmm, is challenging mission code name for pain in the ass? That's one way to put it. Come on, tell me more. Well, the first time we met, she screamed for 15 minutes straight. Apparently I was a demon that wanted to kill her. Oof. Oof. Yeah. Looks like she calls you Lady E. Yeah. I had to pretend that it was one of the urban noble lineage. That was the only way I could get her to talk to me. I gave her a name too. Rosette, right? Yep. It's a lot simpler than princess or whatever, I think. What happened next? Ensue four hours of arguing to convince her that she can leave the tower she lives in. It was a lot of work. And you're making good progress on the corruption? You're kidding. As of now, she refuses to show me even her hair. She's 19, and all she cares about is picking flowers. At her age, I was already slept with at least a quarter of my graduating class. Is it possible to become an Inari? I have a sudden urge to get a degree. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't think that will be possible. Be careful. Special dialogue choices with golden hearts can fail or succeed. The success of these dialogue choices depends on the affinity you have with the character. These affinities can af these affect your affinity and sometimes have short to long-term consequences. Perhaps some private tutoring then? I think I'm curious not to ask more details. Hmm? Oh. How could I refuse such an invitation? You know what? The day I managed to get Rosette naked... Or at least in underwear. I'll open a bottle of Monza and you'll dr and we'll drink together. Deal? Sounds good to me. Wait, let's find out. What's Monza? It's it's a blend it's a blend of apple alcohol and a naughty liquor. You made that up, didn't you? Let's just say it's a family recipe. Okay, sounds good to me. Perfect. Well then, I got to go comfort comfort Rosette. And try to convince her that men aren't demons. Good luck with that. Thanks. See you next time, partner. We're good boys. So, again, if there's any hiccups with the recordings, please give me a break here. I am still kind of getting used to the new PC. Hey, you lady killer you. Whoa, you heard all that? No need to be flustered. You're doing great. Can we just talk about the mission? What was that about the preparations for the coin, for that coin? Okay, so we're gonna need a new outfit for Snow White. What kind of outfit? Well, take a guess. Oh, that would look nice. Kick it me. Oh, what? We'll have, her, we'll have her wear her queen's outfit. So, one, she's gonna turn into a, the queen. Two, Emmy will become dressed, will come dress as the queen's guard. Snow White tells her everything's fine, something like that. Sex stuff. Simple, right? I doubt that'll work out that easily. Actually, I don't care. As long as you corrupt this chick some more. What about the blueprint? Do you know where I can find it? Oh, well, for once, it's simple. Here it is. Nice. I had to fiddle with it a bit. The queen's original outfits, well, not really sexy. But modifying it increased the number of components required to create it. Come on now, make me that outfit. I've waited too long for this moment. Fair enough. Okay, so I just need one clothing scrap. Should be easy. So yeah, sorry about that earlier. I did forget where we left off. I had to go rewatch an episode. We lost all those coins though. I'll take it. Thank you. 
Nice. Not much, but we'll take it. I'll use one of the things. Yep. Let's not get too greedy. We need that stuff so much. Oh, sweet. Hello, colleague. Hi, Emmy. What are you doing here early in the morning? It's almost noon, dude. I finally got in touch with that chick I was telling you about. That wasn't the walk in the park, that's for sure. We can go talk to her whenever you're ready. You're the best, Emmy. <laughs> Save your thanks for when you're actually done. I've had to work with her a few times, and she's really unique, that girl. Is that something I need to worry about? Not exactly, she's just kind of creeps me out personally. Just a heads up, you know. Okay. Get to my ship as soon as you can. See you later. See you later. So once again, thank you to everyone who's been supporting, be it membership, Patreon, subscribe to our OnlyFans, or checking out our shop. They are all linked in the description if you're on YouTube. If you're not, you can always check me out on YouTube under Purity Sin Gaming and Sinfully Pure, my two gaming channels. We also have Miko's Corner, which has cute little pet stuff. I'm also on Instagram and all that other jazz. You know how it goes. So we'll go meet the new girl, since she will be doing that. I need to get another USB hub, like a one that's ba that's got a plug. Darn it, these things are hard. Well, they're not hard to get, just expensive, but whatever. I gotta pick one up. Oh, nice. Yeah, that was a really good day. Hmm? Hmm? Who's the boy? Oh, Anon, you're just in time. Meet Saber. Hello, it's a pleasure to meet you. I... Do you trust that boy, Emmy? For sure. He's a very reliable partner. You can trust him. Partner, hmm. You seem somewhat familiar. Have I threatened you before? I don't think so. Okay, wait a minute. Are you that Saber? The one the Empire has been hunting for for years? Emmy, are you sure he's trustworthy? If he isn't... He is, he is. And he's gone... He's gonna stop asking too many questions. Understood, partner? Yeah, sorry about that, Miss Saber. Just call me Saber, boy. Emmy told me about her new, her new job. Sounds like you two are having a lot of fun. Yeah, it's rather enjoyable. No kidding. Getting paid to bang cute androids? I knew you were a lucky gal, Emmy, but this goes beyond my expectations. Well, I haven't done much yet, but Anon? He's really professional. That's one way to look at it. Well, I'll be curious to see what you're worth in person, boy. Unless you two... Can we get back to our business? Please? Yeah, sure. So, you told me you were looking for something? Unusual. Yeah, kind of. I'll let you know. I need to lay low at the moment. So if you need to get rid of someone, or if it's about... Oh no, nothing like that. What do you even want from me then? Well, the last time I went up to your ship. Yeah? That's okay. I'm interested in the books. My swords are not for sale. That's perfect, because we're contacting you about the books. Well, I'll be... You need books to corrupt androids, really? A dildo sounds more effective to me. Not really, it's... it's complicated. Whatever you say. I can sell you some, of course. It won't be cheap. These things have become rare. Thanks a lot, Saber. I gotta go. We'll talk later, Emmy. And you. 
See you later too, boy. Well, I didn't expect this. You can't say I didn't warn you. Indeed. But at least we have the books now. How did you meet her? That's a good question. Well, a few years ago. You need to keep this to yourself, got it? I'm shutting down Tinker. Fuck! Great. So a few years ago, when I started my final exam... Your final exam? Yeah, it's, well, it's complicated. I'll explain it to you one day. Anyway, I needed money and started working as a mercenary. And on the job, I ended up on a moon that borders the Empire. Doesn't sound very legal, does it? Oh, you're not wrong. The goal was to retrieve some Earth artifacts from a collector and negotiate that price. Damn, your life sounds kind of cool. Eh, that was fun. And Saber was part of the team. That was before she became captain of her own ship. Okay, I see. What about the mission? How did it end? Badly. But at least I made some connections. She seems to like me. Trust me, you never know what she thinks of anyone. I'd say she just wants you in her bed at best. But, uh... I once saw what the orgy she used to host look like. And what do they look like? Imagine Satan on, Satan on a Sabbath. It was. I strive to keep an open mind, but this... It just wasn't me, is what I'm saying. I'm starting to understand why you said she scared you a little bit. Anyway, thanks for everything, Emmy. You're welcome. The book should be on sale in my store by tomorrow, I think. And I promise I won't try to profit off of it. <laughs> That's very nice of you. Have a nice day, Anon. She likes us. So we really can't do anything else until the dress is ready. Unfortunately. I think once Snow White kind of opens up more, that'll open the other girls up. So I am planning on doing other games. Again, by the way, uh, I do some games live on Twitch. Tuesdays is usually my day to stream, and the other days are usually the Eldritch Abomination from Simply Pure. You guys should come and see, though. Sometimes you can see video stuff early. Thanks. We can always use the credits. I wish I could find another boost in the wild like I did a couple times. Not gonna risk it. Nice. So now we can finish that. So I will be doing a couple more visual novels similar to Bacchanalia. I love doing Atomi games, and you guys seem to be enjoying them too. I know it's not, it doesn't have mature scenes like these games, but they have some good stories. Hello, good to see you again. Snow White, one of the Queen's guards is on the way. Let's go to the well, quickly. Oh my lord, that's terrible. But why do we need to go to the wishing well? Because I have a plan, you'll see. We should just wait for the guard. And give him a beating. No. Why? Because I have a much better plan. You know what? Stop arguing and let's just go. Okay, let me change into my traveling clothes first. But, but, we have to go quick. Guard or not, I'm not getting my dress ruined. Damn it, I'm getting tired of princesses. Stop complaining. Emmy is already waiting near the wishing well. And hurry up, I want to see some action. I'm ready, let's go. Okay, what's your plan? Easy, we'll just turn you into the queen. No, we will not. 
but it's just temporary, you know? Mm-hmm. Are you sure there's no other way? I have a better idea. I'll hide in the well while you tell the guard I'm not here. Nope. Or else we knock him out with a... We follow my plan. Hmm. And if you're lucky, you might get a new outfit. Really? Yes, the queen's outfit. Oh. What? Maybe it's a pretty outfit? Nah, I don't want to. Find another way. Anything else but this. Uh, I'm kind of running out of ideas here. Find a solution! Snow White, in the name of the queen, you're under arrest. Hmm. W what the hell are you doing? I was getting tired of waiting in the bushes. What? Uh, no, I mean... Just doing my job, Mr. Hunter. You mean Huntsman. Same thing. You are making a big mistake, lady. I don't think so. There's a pretty penny on your head, you know. Because I'm not Snow White? You throw the coin in the wishing well. And who are you then? Bow down to your queen. Do I need to play along? Yes. Oh my god, I'm sorry, my queen. I didn't recognize you. Excuse me, I'll never come back here again. You really need to take acting classes, Emmy. There you go. That was pretty easy. A little too much, yeah. Well, I guess I'll be safe for now. But I must say, I was expecting you to be more reliable. Are you serious? Anyway, I'll head home now. It'll be nice to have my mind at ease for once. Wait, 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 wait. Aren't you forgetting something here? I don't think... My reward? Oh, no, sorry. I don't think you deserve that. Maybe another time. Oh my god, you've got to be kidding me. After all I've done to you, for you. Red... Wait. Kill red wolf. What's that noise? What noise? And on, we got a problem! There's something fast approaching. I don't know what it is, but all my sensors are going haywire. You should probably get out of here and fast. Snow White, we need to get out of this place. Is this another one of your tricks? Absolutely not. I'm not. <gasps> Tinker, we're under fire. Teleport me quick. Tinker, what the hell is this? We have an intruder on our planet! An armed intruder! Good heavens, what is this place? Oh... Tinker, what the hell did you do? You really wanted me to leave Snow White behind? Mr. Huntsman, I'm not sure what's happening. You are acquainted with a fairy of the well? Main command! Snow White off! Main al Main alarm! Command off! Alright, now we can talk freely. We seem to have an intruder on our planet. How did they land undetected? Well, the global planet scans have been down since, well, 150 years? There's no way to detect something like that unless it's close. Are you saying my life's been in danger the whole time on this planet? Of course not. If needed, I can just warp you back here, You, as you just saw. Did you get a chance to see what attacked you there? Nothing, a humming buzzing. I think I heard the word red. Red? That's strange. Anyway, going to the well is forbidden until we've figured this out. What about Snow White? Oh yes, I will erase her short-term memory. It's really not something I'm good at, so I'm hoping there won't be any side effects. Side effects like what? Hell if I know. I'm not an expert on androids, you know. Speaking of which, hiring one might be a good investment. If we want to make this planet work properly, it's going to be an essential. Anyway, get some rest. You really deserve it. Hmm. Let's go quickly check on the other girls. Okay, we... Anna. So we can't do anything. Okay, so she's kind of locked right now. 
Oh, does Emmy have any books? Let's go see. She might have the sewing book we need. Thanks for everything, anyway. See you next time, Blueberry. See you next time, Blueberry. Hey, I just received your book. Oh, great. We'll finally be able to make progress, Rapunzel. Did you put it in your store, Blueberry? Bloody hell, you heard that? I love that nickname. Yeah, Saber really has a knack for giving people nicknames. That's kind of her special thing. Be prepared to get one if you're hanging out with her one day. Anyway, you want to see my store? Damn, that's expensive. You want to come with me to meet her? Really? Yeah, why not? It could be funny. Oh shit, I wasn't ready for that. Wait, 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 I'll put on my outfit. Vamanos, horror? Yes, ma'am. Hey, nice place. One bedroom, massive wooden floor, and breathtaking view on a superb hidden valley, free of charges. You've got the sale, sir. Mr. Anon. Uh, who are you? Anon, should I bring my pan? No, 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 easy on the pan. Hi, I'm Emmy, nice to meet you. I love your hair. Thank you. I'm Rapunzel, nice to meet you. Hmm? It's, uh... Anon told me that we had to show our breasts every time we meet a new person. I love that idea, dude. <laughs> This is the right thing to do, isn't it? Oh, yes, of course. Everyone knows that. Oh, great. And don't you do it? Don't look at me like that. It's just basic courtesy. Of course it is. Is that okay for you? Perfect. <laughs> I like the blue of your breast, ma'am. Well, thanks, I guess. <laughs> You really are a bunch of per. You really, you really are a bunch of pervs. What's a perv anon? That's uh. Whoop. Emmy, we had a lot of other things to do today, right? Yeah, let's say that. See you later, Rapunzel. I can't wait to see what you will become in a few days. <laughs> I don't really understand, but okay. See you later. Well, you really know how to quickly corrupt the princesses. <laughs> I love this welcome boob concept. See you later, pal. Sweet. Let's get our baby going. Oh, I gotta buy some more. Damn it. I'm gonna risk it. Oh, it's not much money. Nope. Wrong button. Gosh, I'm glad there's a back. That would suck if there wasn't. I'll take this one. Can I read another one? Okay, no. 
Good night. So we really can't do anything. Well, we can go see how she's doing. Tinker, is Snow White ready? Yep, she's back in her home. I almost made one hell of a blunder. I'd have completely wiped her memory. We really need to find someone better than me to fix these androids, hmm? How did you find someone like- how do you find someone like that? I mean, the androids in this park are rather unique. You're absolutely right. It'll probably be extremely hard to find. Anyway, don't go to the well until we figure out what's going on. I got it. Great, I'll teleport you there. See you later. So we're probably gonna get a new girl, another alien. Oh my goodness. I was so scared. I don't know what happened. I, I think I fell unconscious. I have no memory of what happened. It's very strange. Did you bring me home? You really don't remember anything? Well, maybe. I remember we got attacked by some very strange kind of magic. And then nothing. What happened? Well, we've been attacked by... Good heavens. I valiantly protected you, and then I brought you back here. That's exactly what happened. And you're the one who put these clothes on me? Well, uh, no, I will... And it's strange, but I also remember a fairy. Nope, absolutely not. I must have been a dream. Totally a dream. In any case, Mr. Huntsman, I appreciate... I apparently owe you my life once again. And I think I know what would make you happy. Cool. I know how much you love my breath, so here they are. And that's it? Hmm? Well, I was expecting something more. You want me to get completely undressed? No, I mean something more physical. I don't get it. Jokes on you! I'm into that shit! Oh. Sweet. Thought we'd get bad with that. So we still have to read to be able to unlock the other girls. Let's see if there's actually anything there. Oh, that's good. I'll take it. I'd really like to get, like, the, uh, plus finding again on the, uh, energy, but I haven't found that in a long time. Not bad. And then we'll save the rest. So we just need one more chapter. So I think we can do that. We'll go see Emmy, see if there's anything new in the shop. Hey, hi! I was just looking at the images from your performance with Snow White. By the way, nice work, dude. I guess you were the only looking at this for professional purposes. Yes, and I professionally masturbated on it. Anyway, I thought you deserved a reward for trying all this gold coins. Oh, nice. Part one of two. I found a few things you could use to decorate this room. I added them to your computer while you were sleeping. Great, thanks a lot. I have to go. I have a lot of other professional things to take care of. See you later, dude. Hmm. We're here. Since it always seems we need these. There we go. 
Oh, that's cool. Oh, I like that. Oh, that's so nice. That looks fantastic. Oh, yeah, let's go with that. That looks pretty. I have to remember to edit that. <laughs> Let's go visit Emmy. See if she has anything new. Hello, good to see you again. So nothing new from her. Go see if Snow White has anything new. Hello, good to see you again. How are you today, ma'am? Oh god, I'm going so well. I have a gift for you, sweetheart. Oh, an apple cider. Are you trying to make me inebriated? I love it, thank you. So we've done all those. You're good. Alrighty, so, whoops, I guess we'll just go ahead and go on a drone expedition. By the way, if there are games you'd like to see me play, just let me know, and I may eventually get to them. Like I said, I do have a long list of games to do. Um, I wish I had more time and more resources to do more. That's, like, that's why I do some live and stuff. People have asked why I do non-adult games on this channel, and I like to spice it up. If you do want to see the other games I do, like I said, the Eldritch Abomination on, the, on Symphony Pure gets to do a lot of stuff. We do a lot of modded games, like Midnight Suns with sexy outfits and things like that. So if you like to see that kind of stuff and see the newest mods and stuff for different games, please go check out that other channel. It would help out a lot, too. We also have another channel called Miko's Corner, which I'll try to remember to link in the description. If I don't and you guys want to see all my cute little pets, you go ahead and ask and I will give you the link. If not, that's fine. You don't have to watch any of my other channels. You don't even have to watch any of my other videos. As long as you enjoy the video you're watching, that's all I really care about. So we'll start up Anna, and then um, the next time we'll work on Rapunzel. Hey, employee! Hey, Tinker, have you found a way to open the outpost door? Not yet. I'm trying to find a way to do this with subtlety. So I guess blowing up the door wouldn't be a good solution? Indeed. Especially if we blow up the androids that may be hidden. It would be pretty useless. But I came to see you for something else. It really seems like Emmy's having a hard time with Rosette. More than usual? Yeah, it's like she's hit a big wall. Can you go lend her a hand? Of course, boss. I'll go, s I'll go there as soon as I can. N now, is that okay? Well, I... Damn it, Tink! Hello there. I sure didn't expect that fast of a reaction when I asked Tink for help. I'm as surprised as you are. So, what's the problem? It's getting more difficult. Mademoiselle found a new passion in flowers. It's any and all she ever talks about. Try to disguise yourself as a flower? Very funny. I'd like to, but I don't have any left. And anyway, she wouldn't even understand what to do with it. I'll try talking to her. Let's see. I've reached the point where I'm going to take this advice seriously. I'll try talking to her. She might find a man more attractive. This is going to take a toll on my self-esteem. 
She probably doesn't feel anything for me physically. Maybe because she doesn't like the color blue. You're cute. Don't worry about it. Gracias. Lady L. Lady E. Take a look at these beautiful... A man! Hmm? Was that your death stare skill? I didn't do anything! She started screaming for no reason. Shit. If we end up having to reset her, this is going to be a real pain. I mean, not like I made much progress, but still. I'll ask Tinker. Tinker? Oh, fuck. What the hell is this shit? We've got a problem here. <gasps> Whoa, that felt terrible just now. Tinker, what's going on? I think I just got some kind of virus. You're not the only one. Rosette looks infected, too. Well, then. Good thing, good thing I self-installed an antivirus a while ago. Let me check. Yep, all the androids are out of service, too. What the hell? There's some virus spreading. Looks like I need to head back ASAP. Is everything all right? Apparently, it's some kind of virus. I need to get back right away. See you later, Emmy. I wonder what she looks like under these clothes. Go for it, Emmy. Go! Do it, girl! Okay, apparently we're dealing with something worse than a virus. Worse than a virus? Basically, the entire Android network has been frozen. Which is the first stage of an emergency global reset procedure. If that ever is completed, we'll lose all the progress we got with the androids. Shit. How come this got initiated in the first place? I have no idea. And I can tell it's gonna take a while for me to find out. I'll get back to you as soon as I find it. Good luck, boss. Ooh, boy. That's not a good plan. I'm curious, does that mean all of them are broken? This is creepy as fuck. Let's get back to headquarters. I'm curious what they all look like. Hello, Anon. Wait, you're not frozen? Oh, wow. Okay, so it's just tied to her. I did not... What are you talking about? Ah, oh, it's glitching. Is my ba it, is Drony okay? That's all I really care about. Drony, are you okay, baby? Oh, he's fine, everyone. It's okay. Man, Droney's not having a good day. Wow, what the fuck is wrong with you, Droney? Wow, Drony just not having a good day. Well, I guess with that, we're gonna have to call it. Where is, there it is. So let's read a book. Sweet. So we move on to the next day. Wake up! 
I guess not. I've got some news for you. Did you fix the androids? Nope. I figured out where the problem comes from, though. One of the outposts in the Magic Forest vicinity seems to be cause seeming seems to be the cause. It's as if someone tampered with the computers there. I have a really bad feeling about this. Emmy is currently investigating outposts five and six. I need you to take three and four. Okay, and how do I get there? Please, please don't teleport me there without telling me, okay? Nah, they're not far from Snow White's house. Just teleport yourself there, and you'll have to do you. All you have to do is walk a bit. Thanks, boss. And get moving. I can't tell when the whole reset thing will occur. Roger that. Well, we might as well go for a long episode. Hello there. Tinker, what should I go now? Go to the wishing well, then continue straight north. Okay, let's go. Okay, here's the well. Tinker, are you sure someone actually intruded on the outposts? I don't know. What if someone's da what if someone what if it was someone dangerous? I'm sure you'll do fine. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm not sure about that- about this anymore. I don't feel too secure right now. Really? Fine, for fuck's sake, I can scan the area around you if that shuts your whining. Can you- you can do that? I do, though the area of effect is limited. But I do think- wait, wait, wait. Oh my god, I knew it, I'm gonna die. Stop being nervous for no reason. There's some kind of anomaly not far from you. Are you talking about the well? No, it's about 200 meters to your right. Go check it out. I don't get paid enough for this shit. I don't get paid, period. I don't see much. You could at least hire a gardener. This forest is really... It's a forest. Stop complaining and move on. What the hell is this thing? Is that a ship? It looks really old. I don't see what that has to do with the whole virus thing. Hey, wait a second. This ship rings a bell, actually. Get closer. Okay. Can you see better now? Oh my god, I can't believe it. Do you remember what I used to be? Remember that I used to be a military AI? You were... Yeah, you were a... That's exactly right. I'm glad to see you're paying attention to what I'm saying. I'm pretty sure that it's an Empire fire fighter from back then. Wow, really? It's definitely a very old ship. Yeah, it's pretty much an archaeological site at this point. Does that mean you're so old that you're also an archaeological relic? I will stab you! I hate you so much right now. <laughs> Freeze! Identify yourself. Oh, but what the heck is this now? Speak. I... Hurry! I am Anon, a simple adventurer. Anon, you are here on sacred land. Leave this place immediately. A sacred land? You mean this wreckage back there? How dare you! I've already told you to call me if you see any intruders. But, my lord... No excuses. These intruders can be dangerous. My head. So, he's the intruder. <laughs> he's not really impressive. And an arm to boot. Yes, but... Yes, but he insulted the sacred temple, my lord. Really? He does not seem anything like the usual degenerates. Far from it, I would say. You may leave. I'll take care of him. Yes, my lord. You, stand up. Who are you, and what are you doing here? Um, I'm Anon, and I'm an adventurer. An adventurer? That's a first. We are more accustomed to bandits and zealots with a W-marked forehead. But an adventuring android? That's new. Wait, wait, wait. Did you say android? Yes, I... Hmm? Wait, wait, wait. You're not an android? No, I'm not. 
But you, who are you? Uh, it's kind of complicated. Now I can lose the voice. But to keep it simple, I'm a conscious AI. I'm a conscious AI. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. Don't move, I'm calling my boss. Tinker. Hey, you. Finally woke up? I... Oh, who's she? You're gonna love this. She's an AI with a consciousness. Hmm? I think she's coming. Hello, I'm Tinker. I am the CEO++ of this planet. And here is Anon, my employee. Sup? Hi, you can call me Bonnie. Our greatness is coming rather late. It's been almost ten years since I crashed here. Wait, don't tell me. You were the AI from the spaceship? That's exactly right. The Empire's Automated Forces, 2nd Battalion, 4th Squadron. Oh my god, I can't believe it! Yeah, I know. I'm pretty old, hmm? I was Captain Amelia's personal assistant! No way. I don't know what voice I'm giving her yet, so I'll just stick with the one I was having. I remember you. Weren't you next to her during the Battle of the Three Sunset Speeches? Yes, exactly! That was me! Wow. And now you both end up in android fairy bodies? The chances were pretty small. Yes, indeed. How did you end up on this planet? Well, my spaceship was damaged amidst the battle of the three suns. I lost control over both engines and the weaponry, and I started drifting slowly in space. And then, 200 years later, I somehow ended up passing through this at planet's atmosphere. If I hadn't stumbled on this planet, I'd still be lost in the void of space. Why are you in this body? When I crashed here, I apparently fell right into some kind of... fairy village. A fairy village? There were still some... There were still some... There were still some still alive then? There were. Until, you know, I came crashing on them. After landing, I released... I realized the ship didn't have much power left at all. So I started copying myself into the nearest device. And it was a fairy. With those strange colors. Clothes. Have you been to an outpost recently? Yes. How did you know that? It took me years to open the door. You just had to say open sesame to open it. Yeah, well, I made explos I made explosives and well, you get the idea. And you wouldn't happen to have done something to computers in the outpost by chance. Maybe why? Our entire Android network shut down yesterday, so we're looking into the cause nearby. Oh, sorry, that was probably my fault. It's fine. Now that I know where it's from, fixing it should be a breeze. Well, that's that. The investigation is complete. I'll give you two some space. I bet you have a lot to talk about. Thank you, employee. And sorry about the electroshock earlier. No problem. I'm used to it. See you later. So that's where we're going to leave it. Thank you guys so much for joining us for more of Once Upon a Time. I hope you guys have a fantastic day or night. Bye, guys.